as and well. if this is locked in, I will go berserk. There it because is. Because I was playing this before it was cool. This, <laughs> this is this is such a strong pick in the current meta. Top lane Ramus is phenomenal. We're hanging out into the Lulu this time around. Looper is the one actually with the Lissandra. Yeah, this they, is interesting. Wow, you see okay. MLG trying to jump in onto the mid laner Lulu. So getting to see Condi flash forward. He picks up first blood. What a great counter gang. Yeah, and we talked about the growth of MLXG, but Condi is right behind him in terms of up and coming star junglers. MLG looking for his sights onto 957. He did use his defensive call. He's going to try and power ball away. Looper is not able to claw onto him. They do get the lockdown though. 957 is going really low. Condi is going to try and jump in for the counter gang again. The Ramus does, is able to get away. <laughs> We have to see if that Quinn can put some pressure out the rest of the map. Condi is up in the top lane. 957 gets the corn down onto Looper. Looper has to pop the ultimate on himself. Rek'Sai is trying to come in for the counter game, but it's too little too late Ooh, as Looper Rek'Sai goes down the Rek'Sai actually goes over, and I'm surprised he doesn't get dove, but very nicely coordinated there. Gets the early taunt, pops the ultimate as well for the extra magic damage. Anyway, but she a constant pressure as MLXG is going to come for the re-up here, Xie is ignited. Xiaohu moving in. Is he going to look for the dive? He will hurry up forward there with a the vault. Not quite enough though. Xiaohu is going to die to the tower hits. That's a disaster. You're like Diving Lulu, very, very rough. That early pressure that he got. Oh, meanwhile. Yeah, Mata in trouble actually. Explosive charge down. Mata taking a lot of damage. Mystic is going to be oh. moved forward. The exhaust, almost not enough, but he does get it. Gets the reset. Hops his way out of Kondi. Snipes him with the ulti across the, the wall. Throws it out there, cleans him up with the collateral damage. Fantastic synergy out of the WE lineup. He is getting some taste of his own medicine. That must be a night to be able to dish out as Mystic takes a true shot barrage. Here we go. Now we're going to see Wu get jumped on by Zero here. Here comes that teleport onto the lantern from Lulu as Condi's going to try and jump into the back lines. Teleport was cancelled. A little bit of a cheeky teleport play. That's cute. Like, once again, like you feel like WE, they're really thinking about how they're setting this up. They want to go one more time. Could be problems when Mystic Low gets exhausted. Then Marta going to flash him for the ulti. MLXG going to take him out as Marta actually collects kill credit. Now Marta in trouble does hit the ulti from Condi. Shield not up, but not enough damage. It definitely has a lot of damage to his name. And Ooh, here we go. Jungle. He's going to meet Xiaohu inside that jungle. Gets a nice Q off and forces the flash from Xiaohu. Almost takes him down with the collateral damage as well. And they do know what's happening. MLXG might look in for a steal. It does fire the Prey Seeker, but Condi able to lock that one down. So missing a lot of his death centers is a massive. You do see we Waterly. Go. They're going to try and take down this turret. Teleport's coming in from 957 to the bottom lane. MLXG gets thrown into the team. We are going to see Mystic try to back off. Looper has come down into this bottom lane. They're jumping onto 957 now. He can take up a lot of damage, but five people from RNG is a little bit too much to ask for. Yeah. People are doing a good job of threatening that double teleport by having 957 and Lulu split into the two side lanes, but they've now all grouped up. They're going to try and contest this dragon away. MLXG just does a little bit of a drive-by, as now we're going to see Quinn try and jump onto Mystic. The Braum pass is going to go on once again. Mystic's been chunked down to half his health before any fight takes place. And you can see they are going to keep going in for this dragon. It's kind of at 50% HP. It could be a 50-50. Marta is going to get grabbed up by zero as Mystic goes in. Graves able to secure that dragon, but Marta low with a charge on top of his head. Won't do quite enough damage to kill him, but 957 really wants something. He's speeding his way in. He's got Whimsy up as well. But he just can't find anybody to turn. He'll try and cut him off. We'll meet him inside the jungle. Condi's going to try and duel him wow. out. Does a ton of damage with his shotgun. He He's blinded now, seven. though. Ramus jumps in, gets a nice power ball. Xiaohu gets a nice jump away, but it is going to be the collateral damage that takes him now. Condi's been locked down in the uh, Lissandra ultimate and pops the passive design to try and get away. As now MLXG is trying to get into the fight. Well, MLXG could be in trouble. He does go down. 957 claims another victim, and World Elite are going to take a tower to boot. Yeah, up by the Ramus Graves combo. And Graves is. Uh, Graves. Ramus is just so tanky at this point in the game. As long as he's in front of the team, there's not really all that much you can do. Well, we actually have a Baron going on right now as World Leader going straight for it. Zero low does that to Wusha as RNG can look to counter this. Baron is low. Who's going to get it? Condi able to smite that away, but Mata bleeding there in the back lines. 957 not going to live either. Woosh almost gets himself a triple. What did we just come back to? Yeah, so we, but we'll see whether that's something they want to try. Well, Dragon up soon as Ghostblade pop. Who's going to go in for it? He looks for zero, but he doesn't quite find it. Shall we get a storm his way in? If they can kill Mystic, that'd be a great one to pick up. The ulti's there. It is going to take him out. Whoosh with the downtown sniper. The fight is not done. Zero is going to go down as Shao gets another. Sticking zero up shortly. RNG, no, never mind. Going to go back in for it. Ulti out onto Shie. Condi gets tagged by a blinding assault. Looper straight into the middle is going to try and tank what he can. Does pop the ulti. Now MLXG's the one tanking his whoosh. 
Quick of Vegio has already popped that ulti. Condi uses that, and Lulu's going to get a victim. There's a second as Graves takes out the Braum, and now Looper. Looks like RNG may have overstayed their welcome. Nice little escape there, but that was way too risky. Yeah, that was outright, like, disrespectful in the end. They're diving a full tank, Ramus, who has hard CC, a Lulu with hard CC, and her ultimate still available, and a 5-0-3 Graves now. Looper goes down. RNG really are made to pay for that one. And they were able to prove me wrong. They were able to actually defend the turret because they got them to dive them underneath that inhibitor with a tanky Ramus. They're going to get an inhibitor of their own now, or at least the turret. Yeah, no, they definitely will stick around. This might even cost them the game. Only 10 seconds on Wu, so they will eventually back out. But RNG, that is just an unforgivable error. Yeah, with it here. Well, Lee are now 6,000 gold. So, sorry, 5,000 gold ahead of RNG. And they've been slowly chipping away about at RNG this entire game until that turret dive. So Dragons made sense because that's how they're going to try and win it. Just Although it looks like they want to fight. Yeah, it does look like they want to fight. We do see the Ghost Blade pop from Condi here. And the Ghosties are going to slow down Looper and Mata. Zero throws out a very weird hook once again, connecting onto nothing as Looper's going to lock down Condi with his ultimate. But that's a huge ultimate burn from RNG and Water League could just continue pushing here. Mystic gonna go for it, 957 wants the target, he's gonna after Jahu, he blew so many flashes going in, now he flashes in for Mata, that's the kill that World Elite want, Condi is able to get the first one, flash play almost there for Zero, but Mystic, he's gone in aggressive, he's got the Lulu to back him up, and he is just dishing out damage here. Went straight for the front line, but it was the right play as well. They're going for the base. Going to try and finish it off. Yeah, World Elite, they're onto the Nexus turrets now. They've taken now one. They're going for the second. RNG now going to try and contest their base. Look at this. It's Mystic jumping onto the Nexus. He is battering it down as Condi picks up a kill in the back lines. Mystic picks up another kill here, and they're going onto the Nexus. This is game going over to World Elite. And